Hey, what's up, you guys? Sharpness Prime here, and you're watching my Iron Man 3 movie review part 2. I just wanted to mention a couple of things, a couple of things that kind of screwed up in the first part already that you guys made me very well aware of. Thank you so, so much. Uh, that was not Guy Pierce in the Iron Patriot armor, so, okay, that was his henchman. And, uh... The Gwyneth or uh, Pepper Potts's armor suit is called the Rescue Armor. Okay, I got that also. And then a uh, thing I forgot to mention in the video itself is that I was not a fan of the whole Clean Slate thing, the whole Operation Clean Slate. Didn't really like that at all, especially because Gwyneth Paltrow says, Oh, I see how you can get used to this armor stuff or whatever. She's like, I understand it now. And then he goes, Okay, well, now I'm going to do Operation Clean Slate. And it's like, What? Why? Why would you do that? She just said she's cool with it. It's like, it's like if you have a girlfriend that's having a hard time with you collecting action figures, and then one day she finally goes, Hey, I'm actually cool with this action figure thing. And then you go, like, Oh, all right, awesome. I'm going to get rid of them all today. And then, like, what? It just doesn't make any sense to me. I, it didn't... I mean, for the movies and everything, it made sense. But just the way they wrote it in, I didn't think it made much sense. So, yeah. That's all I wanted to say. And I hope you enjoyed the last few minutes of my tight shirt. Like, non-armor, you know, kicking ass and everything. And it's and the tables churn. You know, it's Jim Rhodes that's leading. And he's doing all the badassery. Uh, I thought that was... There's that one shot where he jumps out of the suit and he... Dex dude, I thought that was hella cool. So Jim Rhodes, I thought was badass. I thought he was very, very cool. So, like I said, overall, I did enjoy the movie. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. There's not a whole lot else I think I really need to talk about that, that I think I'm forgetting here. I'm not editing this movie. I'm just throwing it up because, yeah, it's been way late. But, um, yeah, uh, good movie, not a great movie. Oh, the teaser at the very end, the whole thing with... Um, Tony Stark, you know, kind of venting and, you know, ha having his uh, shrink session with Bruce Banner. Um, why is Bruce Banner looking like he's 60? Like, well, why does he look hella old? Like, uh, I just thought he looked hella old and, and they didn't really give us a whole lot as far. I was hoping this would connect us to Thor 2 because that's going to be the next movie. By the way, the trailer to Thor 2 looks really, really badass. I thought Thor 2 looked amazing as far as the trailer goes. And Man of Steel, even though it's not a Marvel movie, whew, man, that is going to be badass. I mean, that that's just an incredible looking movie. And seeing that trailer in the movie theater was like, wow, I can't believe this. Possibly, uh, this is just my thoughts, possibly best DC movie ever. Just going to say it. Just going to say it. Possibly best DC movie ever. So, I'm really looking forward to those movies as well. But the whole thing at the very end was just kind of like, uh, I guess. Uh, it's cool to see um, Mark Ruffalo again, but he looked hella old. And Tony and, and Robert Downey Jr. got younger because he dyed, his, dyed the gray streaks out of the side of his hair. And then... Hulk is older now, so I don't know, but those just little details. Um, yeah, Glenn Webman and, uh, and and Craig Work both said that it looked like they don't really know what they're doing as far as the transitions go, or for Phase Two with the Avengers and all that, and uh, it kind of looks like it. So I don't I don't really know, but I recommend seeing the movie if you haven't already. I don't think I'm going to see it in the theater a second time. I kind of want to, but I kind of don't. And I was looking online at the uh, the cast list and it said Maria Hill's in the movie, but I don't remember Maria, seeing Maria Hill in the movie, so I may have missed that. So I kind of want to see it again. Um, and yeah, I, I hope you guys like my review. I haven't reviewed a movie in a long time. It's been a long time since I've done a movie review. So yeah, I hope you guys like it. hope you like my extremely tight shirt, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.